And this isn't just a big city problem. Red Deer is also facing an opioid epidemic. And in an effort to reduce the number of deaths in that city, officials are trying to get a supervised consumption site up and running like we have here in Calgary. But as the CBC's Dan McGarvey reports, the idea has divided that community. Stacy Carmichael with Turning Point sees Red Deer's opioid crisis up close every day. She says there's no more time to waste. We're going to have to uh, figure out how we're going to work together as a community to keep people alive in this crisis. There's still no agreement on where a consumption site should go, who should run it, or what it would look like. Carmichael wanted to take the lead and run a site from her existing location in Red Deer's downtown, right at the heart of the problem. But local businesses say it's too close. We just really don't have a buffer zone in between. Um, we're talking about a health issue here, and I just don't know that this is the right place to put that. Mayor Tara Villa says the city just changed its bylaws to pave the way for a possible mobile site. But Stacey Carmichael says with three overdose deaths in Red Deer already this year and 50 overdose reversals thanks to naloxone, whatever happens needs to happen quickly. People are dying. People are using in public bathrooms in back alleys. Um, they're not getting connected to services, so the quicker we can go forward, the better. Um, I think we're ready as a community. It would be um, almost tragic to have a location um, be the, you know, the what's holding us up. Dan McGarvey, CBC News, Red Deer.